What's up guys? So we got another video for you. Uh, we're gonna be heading over to Humble Engineering to check out Xavier Wolf's car. Let's get it. All right, so we are now on our way to Humble Engineering. Uh, we took the RSX today, the gas saver. Really good on gas, I like this car. Um, it's about an hour drive, so we're gonna try to make the most of this drive. Side right now, almost there, taking the shortcut through all the other warehouses. Been coming here for a long ass time. I know where to go, where not to go, the back doors, the back ways. All these kids always walking through here, looking at all the cars, checking them out. Oh look, a Honda. Honda, Supra, dude, everything's like, look at that. Box body, Honda. So, we're playing which cars are locked right now. Supra's locked right now. Fox is locked. Let's see if the, the EF is locked. Is it locked? What do you think, 50-50? You think it's locked? It's, I'm saying it's unlocked, because it's a Honda. Oh, it's locked. So the Fox is the only one that's locked. I don't know why I did that, bored as hell. Every time I come over here, he literally has me sitting outside. Like I always tell him, oh yeah, I'll be there at 10. He's like, cool, yeah, pull up at 10 o'clock, I'll be there. And then every time I get here, he's like, yeah, man, I'm down the street. I'll be there in like 30 minutes. So we're always out here and we get no signal out here on our phone, so kind of sucks. Wow. Such beautiful cars. I'm sure everyone already knows what's in the Supra. I'm pretty sure everybody doesn't know what's in this Fox body. I'm gonna give you a little look around, show you. So sick. Nice little notch. Mm, look at all the booty. But check this out. Check this out. Look at this carbon fiber dash. So nice. AM CD7 dash, AM Infinity ECU. But the best part, why does this car need a Infinity ECU? You're asking me? because of this beautiful ass built to Jay-Z GTE non-VVTI. Look at those hard lines coming off the valve covers going to his catch cans, that shit's insane. All the hard line work on his uh, brake lines and all that shit, so fucking beautiful. Damn, look at that. Crimped dash 20 radiator hose. You know those aren't cheap. Custom catch cans by Humble Engineering. Crazy. This is why I sent Wolf's car over here to Humble Engineering. It sucks because every fucking time I come here, he always does this to me, but look at this Wolfie's car. Oh damn, look at the bash bar. He did a nice job. I like it. I like it a lot. It's almost done. Ah, uh, can I see it from there? Nope. Nope. Fuck man, look. Turn around. Turn around. That's that's the car. That's the fucking car. All right, so we're finally inside the shop. Crazy, it's like a little laboratory in here. But check this out, look at this. So he did uh, full exhaust, bash bar. He's not done with the rear bash bar, yeah, he did. Titanium intercooler piping, titanium uh, four inch intake with a, a locking bulkhead. It's crazy, I'll show you all that shit right now. Um, just a bunch, but let's show you the rear for the moment. He's still completing the bash bar, as I said. But then this is the three inch exhaust all the way with the custom tip right there. The stainless steel. Damn. Humble engineering for the win. I could do fabrication, but this is his profession. Do you get me? So I gotta make sure my boy gets taken care of over here. I love the way he does the little tabs. So beautiful. Ooh, the little flex joint right there. That's my favorite piece. Going to titanium, look at that clearance. And then the motor is on solid mount, so it will not be moving. Why is this not focusing? 
Sorry about that. Sheesh. One of one. None of the parts on this car you could just go online and buy. Everything was made specifically for this car. It's crazy. Damn. She looks so much better in person. So the uh, intercooler piping isn't on right now. But check this out. Fucking four inch lock welded inside of the turbo too, so still welds on the outside. So beautiful. RB fittings on the valve cover. Look at this sick ass catch cam custom made. So beautiful. It's my one of my favorite parts. So look at that. Custom bulkhead. The intake coming down right here. Almost done with that one. Dude, this thing is so sick. Oh yeah, I forgot. Oh my god. Damn. This looks better what the hell hand. yeah, 100 There's no pictures do that shit justice. So that's crazy. You guys have no idea how much it is in material just to make shit like that. Well, some of you, some of you do. This car is so bad. Coming along. Coming along. That's crazy. Look at the titanium intake. Look at this shit. So fat. Jesus Christ. Damn. Look at the fitment of the bash bar holding the bumper up. Bumper bash bar is not even completed. Perfect placement of the exhaust. Titanium. Titanium. Nothing but detail on this car, man. Another cool thing, this bash bar is entirely one of one. Usually, like Street Factions, they have a big old triangle that looks like a diaper or a thong in the front. Um, he did dual, obviously, points, jacking points. And then another cool thing is the way he mounted the bash bar. See how he made a piece of sheet metal wrapped it around and bolted it through? Not a lot of people do that shit. That shit's so sick. And you welded a nut on the inside? Yeah. It's crazy. Oh, the dump tube? Yeah. Oh shit. Look at the inside of that. So crazy. So I kind of suck at vlogging. I'm trying to get better at it. We already left. Um, everything's pretty much done. He's just gonna make a couple more brackets and finish up some pieces he's making. Um, so the car's pretty much done. We're shooting to pick it up on Monday. Once it comes back Monday, I am going to pretty much finish up the car, go get it tuned, and then my boy Xavier can finally enjoy his car. It's been a long process, but it's definitely worth it with all the work you guys have seen on the car. It's so beautiful. But now, we got a long ass drive back. Let's do it. So we're finally back at the HQ. Drive wasn't too bad. Um, very, 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 very happy with all the work that uh, Ryan's done over at Humble Engineering. Um, very happy. He's such an amazing fabricator, such a dope guy. Really recommend him if you guys have any serious builds and are looking for like some A1 fabricators. Um, other than that, everything looked great. Um, the check off list was great. So we just um, figured out a couple little things that we needed to add. So he's gonna finish that up and then get the car back to us. So car should be ready by Monday. And once it comes back Monday, uh, we'll probably start just going over every little thing. There's a little, couple little things that I wanna change up on the car. Um, so we're gonna fix all of that and then get the first start up then get it ready for dyno And after she's dyno, then she can go home to wolf He can enjoy her for a little bit and figure out what he wants to paint her um, Other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned. There's gonna be a lot more vlog type videos to keep you guys updated and interested um, I'm trying to start doing more like stupid shit like getting Donor cars and us putting nitrous on them or just slapping some stock one Jay-Z turbos on it and doing some shit that will make the car work but for the low just for fun you know for us not to sell so stay tuned we got a lot of shit coming um hope you guys enjoyed the video have a great rest of your day night wherever you are go ahead and like comment subscribe follow us on our instagram do whatever you guys want stay tuned guys